Hello. 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 Oh. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. All right. So, yeah, I don't know what happened, but I had a new ID, Zoom ID. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I think something happened with my ID. It's not the same with my old ID. So, I tried to fix it. So, I think it's okay now because you're here. <laughs> All right. So, how are you? I'm okay. How about you? I'm good too. Thank you for asking. So, since you don't have any classes again, what just did you do? Mm, today I cooking some cakes. Oh, you bake some cake? Yes. On your own? Yes. Wow. Why did you make some cake? Pineapple. Uh -huh. So what is the occasion? Why did you bake some cake? Mm. Mm -hmm. At home is very uh, boring. <laughs> you don't have anything to do with that. That's why you decided to bake a cake. Yes. Is this your first time to bake a cake? No. Oh, so baking or cooking is really your thing. You do that if you are bored. Am I correct? Yes. Wow, that's nice. So did your mom already taste your cake? Yes. Uh, and how was it? Did she like it? Yes. Wow, that's nice. So, oh, what do you call this? How about your food for dinner? Did you also cook for dinner? Not yet. <laughs> no, so you haven't eaten dinner yet. Yes. Ooh, all right. So, aside from baking cakes, do you also, um, what do you call this? Do you also bake cookies? Do you bake cookies? Yes, but not today. Mm. So who who buys the ingredients for your cake? Mm. I buy it is yesterday. Oh, did you go outside? Yes. Oh, are you already allowed to go out? Mm, not yet. <laughs> but you just go out. And who's with you last uh, last day or yesterday? Mm, my mother. Oh, it's only the two of you? Yes. Mm, all right. So, with all of the cakes, why did you choose pineapple cake? Why not chocolate cake, strawberry cake? Mm, because I have apple. <laughs> oh, all right. I understand. Okay. So, can you still remember what we did last class? Mm. Is it correct now? Mm -hmm. Correct now. Hold on. So, for a moment. Oh, where are we? Oh, I'm sorry. This is not your book. Can you see the book now? Not yet. Oh, okay. Hold on. Is your mom at home already? Yes. Mm -hmm. So who's going to cook for dinner tonight? Mm, my mother. And what is she going to cook? I don't know. You don't know. How about your dad? Where is your dad? Mm, she's, he has work. 
what time is she is he going home? Mm, sometime is six p.m. or sometime he's a police official, so sometimes he he doesn't go home. Really? Yes. So, what do you do when your dad doesn't go home? Mm. Can you ask again? What do you do when your dad can't go home for today? It's usually... Uh -huh. You're just gonna let them, let him? Like, when he can't go home, does he call you? Yes. Mm, okay, all right. So now, oh, I cannot open the book. We are already done in this supplement, so now we are going to have a new book. For a moment, we are going to start your new book with the topic of leisure activity. Can you still remember what is leisure activity? Yes. Mm -hmm. so again, what is leisure activity again? Leisure activity is the activity we do in the free time. Yes, very it's good. Dry. Mm -hmm. Yes, good job. So now we are going to have topic about leisure activities a lot. All right, so for mm. okay, can you please read this? Yes, bracelets, communicates, craft. Improve layers melody. Yeah, so very good. Bracelet, communicate, craft, improve, leisure, and melody. So for grammar, can you please like that? Read the structure. Yes, first of liking plus. I don't know how to pronounce this. Gerunds. Gerunds. First of liking plus two infinitives. If we want to follow a verb with another action, we must do a when none or an infinitive. Mm -hmm, very good. If verbs of liking plus gerunds or verbs of liking plus two infinitives. If we want to follow a verb with another action, we must use a gerund or antifinitive. Okay, so now, can you please listen to the audio and silently read the script too? Because after, so that, I mean, so that you will know how to pronounce some of these words here, okay? So after yes. you listen to the audio, I'm gonna let you read this aloud, all right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's start. Oh. I cannot play the audio. Joking. Can you just please read this aloud? Read it slowly. Yes. Check out this book for my mini guys to talk training South Grace. Must I like it too? Last weekend, we learned some tricks. I love to watch him. It's so much fun. Have you found your craft kit? Yes, I have found this one. It's got everything. Beats, stickers, roots, buttons. Oh. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's take all my settings. Best write up your stress. Next, what does? It's a CD of Vietnamese folk songs. I listen to it tonight, and you'll be able to improve your Vietnamese. Haha, <laughs> not sure about that. 
but I think I enjoy listening to the melodies. Look up the language website I send you. It helps you learn Vietnamese more easily. Yes, I like reading Doraemon comics while I was learning Japanese. Stop reading comics. I bring you my favorite short story this Sunday when we play football. Sorry, but we have to hurry. Mom and Dad are waiting. We need to buy some tools to build a new house for us this weekend. Okay, good job. Can you just please repeat after me? Will. Will. Uh huh. Do you know what is will? No. Will means it is the black. Any kind of not closed. Any kind of mm, any kind of mm, of clothes. Not really. Not all clothes. Coat that is made from the sheep. The sheep skin. Hold on. Do yes. You know, do you know what is sheep animal? Yes. Uh, so we use in their skin to make clothes, to make a blanket, to make a carpet, like that. Okay. Yes. This one. Tools. Tools. Okay, very good. Now, let's see. Did you... Did you read this carefully? Because there are some questions here. Yes. Uh -huh. So we have, you can see this. These are the and these are the choices here. For number one, we have library, bookstore, sports. For number two, we have book, dog, and craft kit. For number three, we have cat goldfish and tongue for number four we have book cd and craft kit for number five we have folk music or pop music or rock music for number six we have vietnamese japanese or english so you have to write the you have to choose the answer, okay? Yes. All right, so please read it together with your chosen answer. One, folk, my, and Nick are in the bookstore. Uh huh. Two, oh. Hold Is on. that answers? No, no, no. <laughs> I'm just going to type it then. All right, continue number two. Two. Folk is looking for a book. Three. Mass is focused. Four. My has found a craft kiss for herself. Mm -hmm. Five next city is a folk music. Six Nick is trying to learn Vietnamese. All right, so let's see. Folk is looking for a book. Number five, number three, Max is fox cat. Oh, it's a dog. Number four, Mai has found a craft kit for herself. For number five, Nick CD is folk music. Number six, Nick is trying to learn Vietnamese. All right, so we, you have one, two. Three, four, 
and five. Wow, you've got five correct answer. Mm, how about you? Do you know what is craft kit? Yes. Uh -huh. Do you try to do some crafts also? Yes. Uh -huh. Like what craft? Mm. Mm -hmm. I forgot the name. <laughs> oh, like, can you can you describe to me what do you do? Yes. Mm -hmm. What do you do? Do you make clothes? Do you make blankets? What do you do? What kind of craft do you do? Mm. Is Yes. Is neat? Oh. Oh, neat is hard. Yes. What do you do? Blanket or clothes? Um, clothes. And do you wear it? Is a small hat. Oh, that's nice. How did you learn to knit? Um, my mother teased me. Oh, a long time ago? Yes. Really? Like how many years? Mm, two years. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's nice. You're very talented. Good job. Okay, so now let's continue. Hold on. Oh. Can you see the book? No. All right, so which leisure activities do you think Clock me and Nick have? Tick the boxes and find the information from the conversation to explain your choice. Okay. So, did you still remember or do you want to have a sneak, uh, short, Review for the conversation because in this activity, you have to put which leisure activities do you think book may and Nick have. Tick the boxes, then find the information from the conversation to explain your choice. Mm, I want to read the conversations. Uh huh. Okay. Tell me when you are done because we'll let yes. you know the move.
tam tam mm -hmm. so who do you think will do the pet training Fuck. Mm. Fuck. Uh huh. Let's see. All right. And how about making crafts? Making craft is my. My. Very good. What thing is Nick? Oh, it's fuck. <laughs> Number four. Four. Still four. Oh, it's yes. Like, uh, hold on. Oh, it's a meek. How about number five? It's Nick. Uh huh. Very good. It's Nick. How about number six? It's four. Uh huh. Very good. How about number six? Oh, what number am I? Number seven. Seven mm -hmm. is my. Mm hmm. All right. So you've got five correct answers. Good job. So here in the seven leisure activities, which one do you prefer to do? For listening to music and <laughs> learning language. Listening to music. Like yes. you're just gonna lay down and listen to the music. Oh, aside from English. Vietnamese. Is there any language that you want to learn to? Yes, I. Um, in the future, when we uh, study down English, um, I want to study French and Chinese. Oh, French and Chinese. But why do you want yes. to study that? Mm, because I like the song of these countries. Oh, you listen to their song? Even French? Yes. Even French? Yes. Wow, that's amazing. I think I never tried listening to it. Have you tried really learning it on your own? Yes. Oh, uh -huh, so... Do you already know a lot of words? No. <laughs> no. So you like, I know why you like Japan, Japanese, am I right? Yes. Because you really want anime, correct? Yes. <laughs> You're a fan of anime. All right. Okay, so next one, let's continue. Complete the following sentences with the words in the box. In some cases, more than one answer can be relevant. Okay, so we have five sentences here who have a, an underlines. So what you have to do is to complete the sentences using the words here. Did you understand? Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's start. You you do leisure activities in your free time and they make you feel relaxing. Two, you can do you can do relaxing activities. Such as hold on, hold on. what is your number one again? I don't know. I think it says. <laughs> you think what? Uh, 
I'm sorry, what is your answer number one again? Mm -hmm. You do leisure activities in your free time when they make you feel fun. Oh. I'm sorry, but I agree. Your answer is oh, fine. Hold on. Oh, satisfied. Yes. Can you hear number two? You can do relaxing activities, such as yoga or exciting ones, such as mountain biking or skateboarding. Mm -hmm. Number three. Mm. Hobbies such as making crafts or collecting things. Are uh, fun? Yes, are fun. How about number four? You can search off the internet, but some people say this boring. You can surf the internet, but some people say this is boring. Uh -huh. You can spend time with family and friends or become volunteer for the communities. This will make you feel good. Yes, yeah, very good. So, for this activity, you've got four correct answers because the correct answer for number one is satisfied, not fan. <laughs> good job. Yes. Oh, but I noticed this once. Do you think internet surfing is boring? Mm, no. Uh -huh. Right, but yeah, I never feel bored. Do you also... Do you also have time to, to surf in the internet? Yes. Mm -hmm. And what do you usually do in the internet? I show something for study. I don't know. Really? Wow. Like yes. You don't, you don't many in the internet? Using the internet? Mm, sometimes I read some book or comics. Oh, ebook. Yes. Mm, all right, that's nice. Okay, so we have leisure time on an average day. We have. Oh, look at here. Look at the following pie chart of leisure activities in the U.S. and answer the question. So. How much leisure time did people in the U.S. have on an average day in 2012? So, data include all persons aged 15 and over. Data includes all days of the week and our annual average for 2012. For 2012. I answer the questions. Mm -hmm. So how much leisure time did people in the US have on an average day in 2012? Mm, it's 5.1 hours. Yes, very good. Wow. So that's quite long. Like it's, I think, one-fourth of the 24 hours. Yeah, I am not very really sure. Number two, what they did What did they do in their leisure time? In their leisure time, they watching TV, relax and things, use the computer, do sports and exercise, 
Chris, social life and communicate and do other leisure activities. Uh -huh. Yes, so they watch TV, they relax and thinking, they use computer for a leisure time, doing sports and exercise, reading, socializing, and communicating and other leisure activities. So what were the three most common activities? The three most common activities is watching TV, um, use the computer for leisure, and socialize and communicating. Wow, <laughs> that is half, yeah, half and more of this pie chart takes over by watching TV. It means that there are a lot of people who watch TV for their leisure time. Let's see many. Yes. <laughs> All right. Number three, what were the three most common activities? I. What were the three? Oh. Oh yeah, I already I already answered this. Okay, so now complete the table with information from the pie chart. So you know we have activity here. For example, relaxing. So the verb for relaxing is relax. Did you understand this? Yes. Uh -huh. Now, what I want you to do is to complete the table with information from the pie chart. Find some words, find some name of activity and their verb. For example, this, relaxing and relax. Yes. Uh -huh. Can you please type it so that I will just copy paste it after? Yes. Okay, so tell me. When you are done. Hello, Ahaan. Yes. By the way, we are going to extend our class tonight. We will end at 6.55 p.m. since we start our class at 6.10, okay? Yes. All right. So continue. <laughs>
I'm done. <coughs> Oops. Okay, hold on. Okay. All right. So let's see. So for name of activity, we have thinking, we have using, we have doing, we have watching, we have reading, we have socializing, and communicating so it's think use do watch read socialize and communicate wow i'm very good you got all the correct answers good job so always remember the the verb for the gerund this is gerund actually that a word or a verb that has ing. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, very good. All right, so next one. Look at the words. Match them to the category labels. Can you please read letter A to letter H? Yes. I learning something interesting. B reading. C spending time with family. D having hobbies. E playing sports, F watching TV, G socializing with friends, H going to control events or place. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. So you have to match it in our number ones to eight, okay? What yes. time is all right, so number one, what is that? Can you please read number one before you answer it? One, skateboarding, football, badminton, is playing sports. Playing sports, oh, I have to answer it. It's E. Okay, hold on, it's letter e okay all right how about number two two a novel poetry a magazine okay it's b reading reading how about number three three the news a reality shows a comedy is watching TV. Watching TV. Mm -hmm. How about number four? For a new language, a skill. Is having hobbies. Oh, is learning something interesting. So letter A. I. How about number five? Five. Collecting stamps, making origami. Is D having hobbies? Uh -huh. Number six. Six. Going to local performance, visiting museums. Is H going to control events or plays? Uh -huh. Number seven. Seven, visiting relatives, going shopping, doing DIYs, is spending time with family. Mm -hmm. And the last one. Eight, text, texting, 
going to the cinema, hanging out, is re socializing with friends. Okay, so let's see. All right, so number. Number one, it's letter E. Number two, it's letter B. Number three, it's letter F. Number four, it's number letter A. Number five is letter D. Number six, it's letter H. Number seven is letter C. And number eight is letter G. Okay, very good. Good job. So you got all the correct answers. Okay, so let's move forward. Pronunciate. Pronunciation. We have clusters brr and pur. Okay. Complete the yes. words. Mm -hmm. Complete the words under the pictures with mer or pr. Listen to check your answers and repeat. Okay. So I'm. Mm, yeah. You have to answer this first before we listen to the audio. Yes. Number one. Is a precursor. A precursor, very good. Number two. Bridge. Bridge, number three. Bracelet. Bracelet. Number four is bread. Bread. <laughs> number six, princess. Hold on. Princess, number six. President. President, number seven. Prison. Prison. Number S is broccoli. Broccoli. Okay, very good. Hold on. Let's listen to the... Oh, it cannot... You cannot play it. Yeah, but it's correct for number one. It's apricot, bridge, bracelet, bread, princess, president, present, and broccoli. Good job. Now, let's see. Please read this. Yes. One, she loves making a precord jam. Two, my dad likes making bread in his free time. Three, he and is our club president. Four, my keeps all her bracelets in a beautiful box. Five, you will need a brush if you want to paint your room. Six, this a wonderful present. Thanks so much. Okay, very good. All right, so and since it's already our time, we have to end it here and we are just going to continue in our next class, all right? Yes. So thank you so much for tonight, Ha'an, and see you again. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye.